try the hottest trends in the coastal bend, and this one really takes the heat, but can I? We're gonna find out. We're at Hot Chicken Run over here off of Staples. It is the newest and only hot chicken spot in the coastal bend, yep. and they have a variety of flavors that will really, truly put even the spiciest palate to the test. I'm here with CJ, one of the owners, and as we go through this interview, I'm going to be trying out some of these flavors from mild all the way to their spiciest, which is Reaper. Yep. So before we start, let's discuss the flavors real quick so we can tell everybody. What do we have here? So here we have no spice and mild. Okay. Onto the hot, onto the ghost pepper. Habanero. I'm sorry, onto the habanero, onto the ghost pepper, onto the Reaper. All right. First question okay. I'm going to ask you before I chew. Okay. Tell me the story about Hot Chicken Run and how you got started. So me and my business partner, we came together. He, he bought up the idea and he said, have you heard of Hot Chicken Run? Went to Houston, tried it out, um, came up with the idea that we can do it better. Mm -hmm. And from there, here we are today. Okay, love it. This is the no spice. It's all about the quality of the chicken. Delicious, really well seasoned for yes, my non-spicy person. That's it, okay. So tell me what it took for you guys to come up with these recipes. So a lot of trial and error and a lot of people were involved. Um, several months went into coming up with the re recipe. Mm -hmm. um, neighbors, family and friends, everybody tried it out, told them to give us uh, their honest feedback and uh, we nailed it. We came okay. up one day and said, this is it. It really is. So far, so good. Awesome. I awesome. like, again, quality of the chicken. We don't have any heat yet, but I really, really love it. So we already talked about the variety of flavors that you guys have. Um, what do you think sets you apart from other hot chicken places or any other restaurant in town? I'm going to graduate to the hot now. Uh-oh. So uh, most definitely the flavors. We have six, six different flavors from No Spice to Reaper. Mm -hmm. And... Um, the way we season our chicken, we use seven different seasonings to uh, get that spice down and that good flavor. So it's just something unique and from the heart. All right, I love it. It is unique, and as much as I love spicy, mm -hmm. usually it's like a really saucy spice, but these are more dry spices, a right? Absolutely, absolutely. Everything is a dry spice. The only mm -hmm. thing that we do do that we do is we use a Nashville hot oil ah. um, to get that that flavor down to kind of connect it yes, to the chicken. Yes, ma'am. The hot is nice. I think for somebody who likes the nice little flavor, nice little heat to their palate, that's going to be a good, safe bet. Yeah. I'm going to graduate to habanero. Now, you mentioned the different flavors of chicken. Did we already talk about the sides? So, for sides, we have french fries, mac and cheese, coleslaw. Um, and the mac and cheese <clears throat> is to die for. Mm -hmm. The mac and cheese is awesome. What makes it special? <laughs> We season it, that's another one of our trial and error deals. Mm -hmm. um, came up with the uh, seasoning, um, took about a month just to get that mac and cheese down, but that is uh, very popular. Our loaded fries is one of the most popular things on the menu, mm -hmm. and we sell a lot of it. So awesome. the mac and cheese is it's most definitely that. hands down the best. Okay, this isn't no box mac and cheese. It, no, Got not at all. We make it, it every day, multiple times a day. Love it. Cabanero is my jam. I could eat that every day. Super good, great spice, and it's got to kind of breathe in it a little bit. So you haven't lost me yet. Okay. I'm graduating to Ghost Pepper. Let's talk about the event that you guys are having uh, this coming Saturday, right? So, so not this Saturday. September the 16th is our grand opening. Uh, we'll have a radio station out here. We'll have uh, a chicken dunking booth. Uh, it won't be a live chicken. It'll be somebody dressed in a chicken suit. <laughs> <laughs> Don't come for us, Peter. And, 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 we'll, and we'll have a hot chicken challenge. We're still working on the details of that, but mm -hmm. we will have a hot chicken challenge. Awesome. Ghost pepper is good. It's got some kick to it. I'm going to have a sip of water to freshen my palate. It's not because it's so hot. I'm just kidding. <laughs> no, it really is. It's hot and it's delicious. Tell me about these t-shirts and how we can earn these shirts. Yeah, yeah, so you can come in. As of right now, we have five different shirts um, and you can come in and buy your shirt. Okay. Before I ask you where to go for more information and before I try this insane reaper, my mouth is hot. Uh -oh. Ghost pepper is hitting. And it's, <laughs> it is kind of a ghost, like it's creeping up. It's okay. creeping up it's on sitting you. on that tongue, it's there like, you, <laughs> you thought. <laughs> so I'm about to try this reaper. Tell me about this fancy shake that you've got. So the so cake scared. shake. The cake shake is our amazing shake and it's exactly what it says. It's a cake and a shake mixed together. Mm -hmm. um, I call it heaven in a cup, personally. But uh, everybody loves it. And with, you got to come try it out. Come by and get your cake shake. Fantastic. Also, a lot of delicious sauces to accommodate your chicken. Yes. Where yes. can go to find you guys online? <laughs> so we're on all social media platforms, Facebook, TikTok, um, Instagram, and just type in Hot Chicken Run. 
they can find us at. Yeah, guys. <laughs> That's it. That's where it's at. For someone who prides herself in spice, I can enjoy it. I want more, but who? It's hot. My nose is burning. <laughs> they did the job right. You guys really nailed these recipes. Yes, ma'am. Thank you. So Thank good. You. So many flavors. So much to try. I'm going to have to chug some water. <laughs> That's it. Make sure you follow Hot Chicken Run. Come by, try their food, do the challenge, and don't forget to tell them Coastal Living sent you. Absolutely. My